Hi, this is Jane from Birmingham Trees for Life. Like many people, I've been really enjoying my garden during lockdown. And today I thought I'd talk to you a little bit about one of the trees in my garden that uh, I really enjoy all year round. Um, it's the rowan tree. You can see it here behind me. It's in flower at the moment um, and the bees are really loving it. So I'm just going to tell you a little bit about why having a rowan tree in your back garden would be a really nice idea for both you and the wildlife. Um, as you can see, it's in flower at the moment. It has these really lovely creamy white flowers. Um, I'm just going to give you a close-up. The bees really love the flowers. Um, we very often get the tree bumblebee enjoying the flowers. Um, and then once the bees have pollinated the flowers, uh, we get really lovely red berries, giving you a beautiful display in the late summer and into the autumn and the berries provide an, a great food source for the birds so we're feeding the bees and the birds with this tree and then in the autumn it has a really fabulous display of bright red leaf colour it really looks very fiery and like a big flame in the sky in a good year and uh, this particular variety uh, its full Latin name is Sorbus occuparia shearwater seedling uh, it's been bred to be suitable for uh, medium-sized gardens it never gets too wide and uh, this one's probably at its maximum height now it's uh, been in about 12 years so it's a really beautiful tree it gives you lots of interest all year round uh, great for a medium-sized urban garden and I can't recommend it highly enough so I hope you uh, think about planting a beautiful rowan tree in your garden there are smaller ones lots of different varieties um, there's definitely going to be one that's uh, going to be the right size and uh, suitable for your garden. Thanks for listening.